so I'm going to talk about shot focus. This is a uh, the script I wrote last night. A bird flies through the sky, cuts through the clouds, and we re reveal Gary is riding on top of the bird's head. The bird swoops upward and lands on top of a mountain peak. So I'll get that in the script. It'll be an action description. Uh, none of this is formatted to script, so it, it doesn't look like this, but. So you read the action. Okay, the first thing, bird flies through the sky. Well, we have to in introduce the bird and we have to show it flying. So that'll be the first story beat. And I'll, it's good to start on some kind of inanimate object. A lot of times when introducing a character, just cutting to the character is very jarring. So I'm like, what if we start on the sun and we, the bird appears, you know, um, as a silhouette because it's backlit by the sun and then we pan down with the bird and we swoop up and me as an audience, I'm seeing this strong silhouette. I'm like, okay, there's a big bird. There's a bird. The next moment is it cuts through the clouds and we reveal Gary is riding on top of the bird's head. So um, here it make it clear Gary is on the bird and where my thumb, I'm like, what's the clearest shot I can possibly think of of showing Gary on the bird? Probably something like this. I can worry about, you know, adding the cloud elements and all that, you know, maybe there's a cloud and then we see the bird burst through it with Gary. So I'm, I'm working out how, how all this happens. And then we're, you know, in that kind of tracking shot with Gary. Uh, or, you know, maybe I don't need that at all. Maybe we can just cut to Gary. But the, the point is, Gary's on the bird, so how do I show that? Um, in the clearest way possible. And then the bird swoops upward and lands on a mountain peak. So here, bird lands on a mountain. How can I show that again in a really clear way? I could shoot it from the other way, but that's not as clear if, um, you know, the bird swoops in. Woo! and lands um, maybe more in the foreground on a mountain peak. Like I, I wanna make it really clear that it's a mountain. So I shot it at this direction. I thought about um, uh, how do I introduce the mountain? I think a pan would be a simple, nice way where we're tracking with the bird. We have something to track with. We pan with that animation to the new element I'm introducing, mountain. And then I show bird land on mountain. So you got to be um, really, I don't know, kind of a nerd and just go through, bird flies through the sky. Um, that's the first shot I could do that. Gary's on top. Bird swoops upward and lands on a mountain peak. And um, so I'm like, okay, I'll do this in three shots. And then I draw the sound thumbnail and then maybe I'll think about it later. I'm like, oh my gosh, if I just did one background, maybe I have the sun here. Um, you know, the bird swoops in and then maybe we go to uh, speed lines or something and Gary's on the bird and we're tracking with him for a bit. And then, you know, maybe we have the mountain here. Maybe I can combine it all into one shot. You know, I'll, I'll approach it from every angle and in the end I'll try and figure out what's best for the production. So sun. Lands there in mountain. This would probably be better for a feature where you can have, you know, crazy camera moves and you can track the stuff. For TV, I kind of like this more because um, easier to produce. This is a bit harder to produce for animating the bird rotating and stuff. This for cutting on all the difficult stuff to animate. So I, I approach, that's kind of my thought process. Um, break down the information and then how do I show that as clearly as possible and then <clears throat> if I want to I could uh, you know if I'm like well that's pretty clear maybe there's a fun crazy shot where you know I'm on the back of Gary and it's a GoPro type shot where we're with him and um, you know like never-ending story <laughs> style we're flying with him like maybe I could get away with that and still introduce Gary in a fun way. 
like he's turned back you know a cloud whizzes by and he turns to look at it as it flies by so we get a clear view of his face and then he looks forward again you know I'll, I'll try and put in a fun shot so it's not just distillation of information Thank you.